like having an iced coffee. I usually don't do this during the cooler months, but spring is upon us and I really felt like having an iced latte. This is with almond milk and it truly tastes delicious. It is 11.30, it's Saturday today and I'm about to get ready and change because I'm going to have lunch with two of my friends. We are going to try out this place that I recently went to for drinks but they also have a lunch menu and I've never tried it so I'm excited to try something new. I usually just go to the same kind of places that I always go to. I just don't want to be disappointed I guess. I do love trying new cafes and new restaurants and new bars and I don't know so I'm excited to put on a little outfit Fit. Recently I've been feeling a lot more confident which is something that I'm really enjoying. I am a huge introvert as you guys know and I feel like recently I am feeling so much more like myself and I'm just taking a bit more risks. It was one of my goals for this year too, to say yes to things more often and do more things out of my comfort zone. And I feel like recently I've been really doing that in every aspect of my life, really. I've been having a lot more fun with outfits. I've been saying yes to more opportunities, trying out different things. I don't know, just getting out of my comfort zone, which I'm really enjoying, but which is also super scary. But I feel like I'm becoming better at it and I feel like it is also just boosting my confidence overall. So yeah, let's go and pick an outfit. Okay, I'm going to wear my favorite baggy jeans. I bought these on Vinted and I feel like they were pretty much brand new, but they, it doesn't have a label in it, which is so weird. So I don't know what the brand is but these they are my favorite baggy jeans and then I have this top from Jade London which is impossible to see what it's like if I hold it like this so I will just put it on real quick this is the top how pretty but this is way too cold so I'm going to wear a blazer like this yeah I think that's very cute and then this has been my absolute favorite lip combo recently it is the MAC lip liner in chestnut and then this lip glow oil from Dior in cherry I'm quickly using the viewfinder for this. Voila. What are we gonna do for the shoes? Oh, I do have to be careful that I don't flash anyone. I would love to wear these. They are so pretty. I've had these for years, but they are quite high. And if I want to walk to this city, this is not gonna be an option. So I could also just wear dress down and put my Salomon sneakers. And I think that this will be the comfiest option. So. Let's put on these shoes. This is the full outfit. Tuesday. I had some very busy days, but we're back. I actually had a super chill morning. I've been waking up, I mentioned this in a previous video, but I've been waking up early in the morning at seven and the first thing I do is journaling and I'm actually so happy that I got into that habit of journaling in the morning again because it just, it gets me in such a good headspace and just very energized and excited for the day. I'm drinking my morning coffee and I've just been getting ready. I just did my makeup. Now it is time to get dressed, but oh my gosh, it has been so hard to get out of this super comfortable set from Organic Basics. Organic Basics is a 
Copenhagen based brand and all of their clothes are made from organic, recycled and eco-friendly materials. This set is from their new merch collection which is made from 100% GOTS certified organic cotton. It is so freaking soft, I cannot take this off. I really like it because Obviously it's a basic, but I love the green detail of their logo on the hoodie and it's also on the pocket of the joggers. I've also been really obsessed with their Core Cotton Intimates collection. I don't really like wearing a bra because I just I just prefer not to, but sometimes when you wear, it, for example, a t-shirt or a specific top, for example, the top that I want to wear later today, which I will show, you just need to wear a bra and sometimes it just looks better and it feels a bit more comfortable if you do wear a bra. It's actually really comfortable. It is perfect for underneath a t-shirt. It doesn't show any lines and it's super soft too. Getting out of your comfort zone does not have to be uncomfortable, guys. I will tell you that. I actually have a discount code for you, which is Iris X. OB and with that code you will get 10% off everything organic basics. I will just link everything all the pieces in the description so you can shop what I got but maybe you want to try something else as well. Yeah I'm going to meet my friend Lena in a few hours and I also have some work to do so now it is really time to get dressed. So this is the top that I was talking about with the organic basics bra. As you can see I need to wear something underneath um, for obvious reasons and because the bra is so simple it doesn't distract from the top itself I think so it is actually perfect and I think I'm gonna wear these vintage Levi's jeans that I've had for so long but I honestly forgot that I had these because they used to be very tight um, but they do fit me a lot better now so I think I'm gonna wear these let me put it on. I like these because they are a bit more low rise. Not too much though, because I don't like that. And the length is a bit longer as well, without it being too baggy. So yeah, I think this is it for the fit for today. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna wear them with my cowboy boots. I think it would look really cute because I also wanna wear brown leather coat. So maybe the cowboy boots, or I'm gonna go for comfy and wear my Adidas special, but I'm not too sure yet. I'm not gonna wear shoes anyways right now, so I will just show you guys the full outfit once I leave. Now, it is time to get some work done. I'm super busy, so let's stop talking. <laughs> Okay, quick OOTD because once again, she is in a hurry. I need to catch the bus in 10 minutes. Um, so I am wearing the top that I showed you earlier and the pants. I decided to go for my Adidas sneakers. This coat I thrifted and then this little scarf. I decided to put on a headband because my bangs are annoying me so much. And I actually am wearing a black bag. Usually I'm like no black and brown leather mixed, but I feel like this is such a dark brown color. So it works, it works for me. Um, I really need to leave. I'm out of breath already. So let's just go. back home hold on i'm gonna wash my hands real quick <sighs> my god i have been cold all day literally i'm freezing and i still have to go on my run i should have done it this morning already and i kind of knew that when i woke up this morning i should have just gone straight for my run but i didn't i decided to save it for right now um so i am going to quickly charge my phone then i'm going to put on a warm t-shirt and then we're going for a run it isn't even that cold outside i don't know why i am just so freaking cold today i wasn't dressed very warm either so 
Anyways, uh, I had such a fun day with my friend Lena um, and I actually found the perfect pair of low-rise jeans. I have a few jeans. I was talking about the one I'm wearing right now. It is a bit more low-rise, but it's not really like low-rise, low-rise. I was just talking about this this morning and then I found these at Reshare store, which is a charity shop actually. And they are Tommy Hilfiger denim. They were only 20 euros and I put them on and they were actually the perfect fit. I really like the washing and it's not like I don't have any blue jeans, but I don't own a pair of low rise jeans yet. And you know, we're doing things out of our comfort zone. So I was like, I kind of need these because they were the perfect fit. They looked really good on me too. So I got them because I thought that I was going to regret not getting them. And look at it. It's like a very beautiful color as well. And I also found this belt, which was two euros. And I thought it was really cute. I My mom has a belt that is similar to this one. It's a bit smaller. And I sometimes borrow it from her. And now I have one myself. So I don't need to borrow her belts anymore. I really don't have enough belts. I don't know why. I think it's just because I don't know my size. I have no idea what size belt I am. So I only have like two belts that I really wear all the time. A brown leather one and a black leather one. I've had those for years too, but truly a cute belt can really make your outfit so much better. And I was looking for something like this. And the good thing about a belt like this is you don't really need to know your size because you can also make this a belt, like a waist belt as well. Cause you know, it has the holes throughout the whole belt. So I could even wear this as like a cute waist belt. Anyways, successful shopping day, successful day in general. Um, the only thing that I need to do right now is go for my run. So yeah, I'm just gonna do that real quick. And then we're gonna take a very hot shower, which I'm really looking forward to. Absolutely smashed my 5K PB. Very unexpected, but it felt amazing. I said I would do a quick run I wasn't lying. So let's take a well-deserved shower. Let's put this back on. So it is time for dinner. And luckily for me, we have leftovers. Yesterday I made a very big pasta. And when I talk about getting out of my comfort zone, I also mean trying different types of food. I have been saying this for a while now, but I really wanted to try out new recipes and put more effort into my meals because I feel like recently I've been so lazy, especially with, you know, I just eat the same kind of things over and over again. And I just wanna, I wanna try out recipes that I've never made before, for example. So yesterday I actually made a, a pasta pesto with homemade broccoli pesto. And it was actually really, freaking good and leftovers just make me so happy because it's literally just heating up my food and then we can eat hey guys i've been having such a busy day with work i've been working non-stop it is now 3 30 and i'm really running behind on schedule i just have so many things that i wanted to finish for today and this morning i woke up at 6 30 i was doing so well but i don't know what happened but the past few hours i just have been i feel like i've been doing everything in slow motion and i'm literally this tornado in the house every room i enter i leave behind a, the biggest mess ever so i'm only making my to-do list longer anyways i really need to go and pick up a package so that's what i'm gonna do right now also i was thinking this whole time that i needed to go do grocery shopping then i realized i'm going out for dinner tonight so i don't even need to make anything and i don't need to get groceries so that's a big win so i just i'm quickly going to pick up this package then that's done then I'm going to clean real quick and just organize the house. And then I'm going to go for a run and then I will take a bath. That's kind of my planning for right now. I I just, I can just sense that I come across as chaos right now. You, you are probably watching me and I'm, I'm sorry if I'm making you nervous, but anyways, I'm going to pick up this package and stop yapping because it's all a bit too much. Okay, 
I quickly got ready um, because I'm going to dinner with my friend on the lot. We are gonna try out this new restaurant they recently opened. The place itself isn't new, but they used to have an outdoor bar and they completely changed to an insta inside restaurant. And I think they are a club at night, also outdoors during summer. So completely new concept. I'm very excited to try it out because um, I think their food concept is street food style. So yeah, I'm just, I'm really hungry too. <laughs> Literally talking about it makes me extremely hungry. Um, yeah, my friend is going to pick me up and then we're gonna drive there because it is on the other side of the city. It is called the Achtertuin. If you are from Nijmegen, you probably know what I'm talking about. So I will just quickly show you guys my outfit. The lighting is so bad, so I hope you can see it, but I'm wearing this blue crew neck, these leather pants and some heels, bring my Holen bag. So excited to put on my PJs and go to bed because I'm absolutely exhausted but I had such a fun evening with amazing food everything was so delicious and yeah I just had such a fun evening so I will definitely go back there again but yeah thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog don't forget to check out organic basics and use the link in my description to get a discount and yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little vlog and I will see you guys next time.